Incoming transmission. Good morning, cadets, and welcome back to our Mass Effect Andromeda playthrough. Where I think it's time to do another checkup with our crew. And let's start with Suvi, then Kello, then PB, and all the rest. Suvi? The discovery of Aya was just what we needed, Ryder. The Angaran scientists have been so generous in sharing their wisdom. It's been amazing. Yeah, I think it will be a tremendous help. And Garan expertise will be a tremendous help to the initiative. We were certainly hurting for it. I'm thankful the Angara were willing to risk working with us. I'm afraid not all of them are quite so friendly. Some give trust easily. From others, you have to earn it. I'm confident we'll get there. Yeah, maybe. Or one day. But unfortunately you don't have anything else to say. I should get say. back to things. Sounds good. So I'll catch you later then. Carol, everything okay between you and Gil? What can I do for you? Mm, opinion on the others. What do you think of the rest of the crew? No, oh, <laughs> if I gossip anymore, I'll get in trouble. Ah, so you don't have anything else to say. What about the Tempest? Tell me something else about the ship. O'Connell, our systems designer, was running a power distribution model. How power moves through the ship. Uh, I think what do you have this. to lock his turn. Yep. For two days. Poor O'Connell was convinced that turning on all the bathroom lights... I'll let you concentrate. You know where I'll be. Thank you, Carl. For now, you don't have anything new to say. Right, BB. You have AVP outstanding, Pathfinder. Yes, thank you, Sam. We'll get to the Nexus soon enough. Nah, -uh -uh, no peeking. I'm putting the finishing touches on my personal project. Uh... I thought you said it was on the Nexus. I'm just perfecting the final component here, or should I say, trying to. Several of the crew have offered to help, and I keep politely declining and ushering them out. So, thank you for retrieving that critical piece of Remtech, but kindly stop digging. Well, I can't help it. I'm curious about it. You're the one, the one that told me to meet you here. I'm naturally curious, and I'm sure the crew just wants to bond. Curious is good. Builds anticipation. I'll leave the bonding to you. Not my style. I realize it must be hard being the Pathfinder and not being able to know everything. But there's so much you can do that no one else can. It's safe to say that you, my friend, are one of a kind. Well, it's true. You've only scratched the surface. You have no idea what all I can do. No. But I have an active imagination. I look forward to being educated. But no more distractions. The next time you're on the Nexus, my project will be done. Come by, and I'll unveil it. Now, if you will, please leave me to my own devices. Okay. So we need to meet her in the Nexus apartment. Got it. But do you have anything else, though? To say? Hey there. Uh, Got a sec? Sure. Uh, I think maybe it's still the same option, but... I like it when you flirt. I wouldn't want you to stop. Have I flirted with you? <laughs> Don't worry, Ryder. I'm relentless. It relaxes me. Thanks for chatting. We'll talk again later. You See know you, Phoebe. Alright. So, nothing new? That's the airlock. Who was down? Drac, Vetra, Sam. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna go down, check with uh, Sam, Vetra, and Drac, and then we're gonna come up to from this elevator and start with Joel, Liam, Lexi, Gil, and have. The last one being Cora, which means we're gonna take the stairs. Hopefully, no conversation happening. We didn't get any other emails, right, Sam? Just double check. No, we have everything. Hello, Sarah. Any other jokes? How are those jokes coming, Sam? What is green with red toenails? No idea. What is green with red toenails, Sam? A Krogan, 
masquerading as a cherry tree. Uh. What? Oh, okay, I might need to read that one again and do some research because... What? How are those jokes coming, Sam? I am formulating a new one. Yeah, okay, because the last Thanks, one Sam. was... Nothing more. I, I don't even know what was the last one. Joke or... What? Right. You know, there was a time when Sid was afraid of space. We were traveling a lot, and one day she just woke up and realized there was nothing outside the shuttle walls. Happened more than once. She'd panic. I'd hold her for as long as it took. She doesn't even remember now. It was only for a month or two. Funny, huh? The things they don't remember. And you feel like it's up to you to hold on to it, or else it's just gone. And there's just something there that you know you're missing. Drag? Just hold on to it. Oh, that was really sweet. Let's check the info board first. Right, Angaran word of the day. Tavum. Tavum. Uh, neutral. A pleasant, intoxicating, stirred into hot water or fruits juice. Say Tavum. Tavum. Okay. Comments. What is what? What's it made from? Is it sweet or more like beer? Vetra. What happens if we mix it with booze? Does it get better or do they cancel each other out? Drac. We need to do some scientific scientific tests. Maybe with little umbrellas. PB. Uh, be careful on that one, guys. And let me know how it goes. It's all on you. Vetra. Ryder. Mm, I'll let you for now. You probably have work to do. We can chat later. You know where to find me. I'm curious if they have more to chat uh, after I talk with Ephra from the meeting room. Hey. Mm -hmm. I think we can talk more later. As sure. well. Oh well. Where's the pie jack? There's the Nomad. Joel is over there. Biotics. That's how it's said. Yep. Hmm. True. Joel? Anything to say? Is there something else? A few more questions, if that's okay. Mm, well, we won't know till we try. Okay, tell me more about the Angara. I want to learn more about your species. What would you like to know? Uh, what's... What religions and beliefs do you have? Is there a central Angaran religion? There are many variations. An almanac could give you an accurate number. But uh -huh. if you are a believer, the essential tenet is, after we die, we are reincarnated. We evolve to make our families strong. Born from what was before. Blessed to be better than before. Are you a believer? No. Mm. Yes. <laughs> Sometimes. I don't know if it's the same for humans. Sahuna, my true mother, is a firm believer. Your true mother? Okay. How many colonies do you have out there? How many colonies do you have? On what planets? Since the Scourge, we've managed to survive on a small number of planets. What we know from before the Scourge is mostly oral history. We did have spaceflight, and the stories tell of five original colonies okay what about temperament the angara seems so open and free with their feelings are we hmm. Hmm. we're certainly not ashamed of our feelings we're taught that feelings and beliefs should live on the outside where they can be dealt with honestly and openly don't people get hurt of course 
Then everyone deals with it. That's the point. Joe. Okay, what about uh, biology? How long have you had electromagnetic capabilities? How did they evolve? No idea. Biology doesn't interest me. But I'm sure you can easily read up on it. That's disappointing. No biology at all? How do your eyeballs work? An internal lens focuses an image onto the retina where it becomes electrical impulses that are deciphered by the brain. You took my sarcasm as an invitation to show off. Pitiful. Well, <clears throat> okay, yeah. Maybe both. What's this about the Moshe that I heard about it? You studied with Moshe Sefa. Is she a teacher or a religious figure? She's many things. She's a clear thinker with deep knowledge and insight. She teaches and inspires. She's beloved. I love her. Hmm. It seems you're not the only Angora. People are willing to die for her. She sounds pretty special. She is. I hope you get to know her. Well, enough about that. Okay, what can you tell me about the cat occup occupation? What do you know? Can you tell me more about the cat occupation? It's a difficult subject. I'll answer what I can. I may get emotional. So you have personal experience with the cat, more than just shooting around. What's living under the cat been like for you? Do you really want to hear about these things? They're painful. I asked, didn't I? It's like living on unstable ground. Every day brings more horrible news. I part company with someone not knowing if I'll ever see them again. When I was a boy, my father vanished from my life. One horrible day. Was he in the resistance? No. He was a technician at a mine. He went to work and didn't come home. That happens for an Angara child somewhere every single day. I see. What do you know about the cat arrival? When the cat came, why didn't you fight? They didn't give us a reason to. Until they did. Then it was too late. Perhaps you think we were weak? But the cat are ruthless. They are masters at knowing exactly when and how to strike. I get that, believe me. Okay, what about their Archon? Have the cat always been here? No. Some, like the Moshai, are old enough to remember the time before the cat. But I don't. Nor do my mothers. And the Archon came with them? We think so. Resistance intel on that is unclear, and few have seen him in person. And live to tell? And live to tell. Okay, I think this well, is... enough about that. This is as much as we can talk about, so I'll let you be. I'll see you later, Joel. Stay strong and clear. Likewise. All right. So we have Liam, Lexi, Gil over there. You guys playing nice here. Should have seen it. Perfect drift. You know we've got a finite set of tires, right? Also limbs and lives. True. Well, what's the point of having them then? Liam? Damn, what was that? Right, I guess I'll talk with you up there. Or not. Tev Uni. A home on Vold. Sort of. Still feels good though. Yeah, but unfortunately you don't have anything else to say. We'll talk later. I know it. Right, anyone else bugging out? Feeling like drifting? Let's check the <laughs> strike teams. Because we haven't checked that one since... We landed. Okay, and then we have claim all rewards. It's 
and strike team. 90%, yes. Two. And then 94. That's good. Hey, Lexi. Feeling okay? Uh, yeah. Um, I'll see you around. You know, if I'll let you to get say. back to it. I'll be here if you need me. Uh, what are you guys watching? Oh, I think this is the uh, cat base. Got it. And we got another adventure rifle, which probably gonna disassemble. Gil. Hey, Ryder. What's the story? Not much. We'll catch you later. Good talking to you, Gil. Anytime. It's apparently you don't have anything to say. So that should leave Cora. Did you hear the news from Eos? Asari refugees showed up at the outpost. Only a few. But that's better than none. Bradley says there's an officer in charge. Hidaria. She could know where the Ark is. True. So we should speak with to her as soon as possible. We'll head to Eos and see what she knows. Good. Rumor says Sarissa Theris was on the Asari Ark. Exactly who we need. Who's she? Probably the best commando strategist alive. Her biotic shields saved hundreds at the Battle of Kirkus. Apparently, Sarissa's acting as bodyguard to the Asari Pathfinder. She's probably got a plan out of this mess already. So is that like your hero of sorts? Well, someone's a fan. No, I... I just like... Look, we need someone with her experience. That's all. True. Seems smart that we need to have there. I'll take someone with that much experience. Another reason to find the Ark. Indeed. When you're ready to look, we can catch Hidari at Prodromos. Wouldn't mind tagging along. Okay, so we have to take Korra. Anything else, Korra? Besides the Asaris? Uh, I don't think so. See you later, Cora. I'll be here. Okay. All that's left is to talk with Ephra. Bitcoin channels already, Pathfinder. Yes, activate. Commander. Pathfinder, Joel's been keeping me updated on your adventures, your good deeds on our behalf i meant them i want you to know you can trust me you rescued shabbat Khan. his loss would have been hard for the resistance but your true agenda is clear to explore Aya's vault jarl says you want to help find the moshai why should i let you i keep my word i'd like this to be the beginning of a strong relationship gave your promises and little by little our bond might grow We've managed to trace the Moshai to a special cat facility on Vold. Really? My special? These facilities are protected by a dynamic shield tech we haven't been able to crack. We're close, but its ability to adapt outstrips the speed of our current processors. Pathfinder, adding my processor to that program would no doubt make the difference. Ephra, I can help. Respectfully, this time you need my help. Respectfully? The Angara don't need anything from you. We take care of our own. Hmm. Okay. If you... You're like that? Who am I to intrude? What I meant was... Let our scientists help with your program. Let my team join your effort. <laughs> Let's up the chance for success. I'm offering. You should accept. Very well. I'm not stupid, and I love the Moshai. You're welcome on the mission. Thank you. The team will meet you at our base on Vold. They'll take you to the Ket facility. Stay strong and clear. Goodbye. Jal said he wanted to see you. Of course. Okay. Uh... Yeah, you moved here. So... You've gained Ephra's trust. No easy feat. Yeah, but it's not all good news. Yeah, but at a price. Mm. 
You mean the Rokar? <laughs> Don't take it personally. They hate all aliens. Ephra made it seem like you had experience with them. I know their leader, Aksul. We studied together under the Moshai, <laughs> but unlike me, he was a good student. The best, actually. Then he knows about Remnant? He did. <laughs> it's a long story. Give me the short version. Aksul was captured by the Ket. He spent a year in a forced labor camp before he managed to escape. Okay, so that explains his hate for aliens. Got it. That's why he hates aliens. Yes, he suffered greatly. When Axul returned, he no longer cared about the remnant or anything except destroying the Ket. Why not join the resistance? Axul's not the type to follow orders. And I think he was bitter we weren't able to rescue him. So he formed the Rokar. We didn't give them much thought. But since your people arrived, his cause has grown. Then I... <clears throat> right, then I guess we need to st either stop them or reason with them. More of a reason to set things straight before they get out of hand. I don't think Axul will listen to you. He'll make you want to kill him. I have to try. If Helios is to be your home, I guess you'll have to deal with the Rokar one way or another. There's a recluse on Havarol who escaped with Axul from the Ket. Her name is Thaldir. She might know how to contact him. I'll send you the nerve point. Okay. Thank you, Joel. And I think this should be everything. We have this one. We have the Turian Arc on Haval. And then we have Eos. On Vol, what I have the architect. I think. Oh, actually, we do have trading favors. Maybe we'll do a quick pit stop on Aya to give the quest away and anything else. Minerals, Remnant Data Core, did I make a level? No, not exactly. Alright, so I guess I'm gonna go quickly to Aya then, unless I wanna explore a bit more. Again, I'll lend you 30 if you pay me back by tomorrow. Done. Thank you, Suvi. Someday I'll find out why you're always strapped for credits. Mm, I'm curious as well, Kialo. What are you doing <laughs> with the credits? Okay. We should have. Steady. Yeah, we have Trail of Hope, Missing Science Crew. Uh, yeah, not that one. Space. System view. Do you have any more opened? Or now oh, we have the Havarl one. Everything else is done. Right, let's go to Aya. And then I guess we'll go to the Nexus afterwards. To also have the poker game. I can feel the Scourge's drag on the ship. At least it keeps Aya hidden. And also movie da database. We still have that one for for Liam as well. And then PB. And maybe something else when we get there. Or maybe Aya is fully opened up because we had some uh, 
areas we couldn't explore yet. So maybe now it's available. So I guess we'll see. Don't think so. I still see. Yeah, locked doors. I'm here to assist you, Pathfinder. Yeah, let's just deliver the supplies to. You came back. I have bad news. Your supplier, Keldo. The cat got him. Thank you for confirming how he died. You have his supplies. Yep. Keldo ran weapons for the resistance. You were his contact. Good, good. Continue. Ephra asked you to test me, see how I'd handle myself. And I told him you were smart. The cat had your weapons. I got them back. Yes, all of them. And kill those killers dead. This is good. You're honest, Pathfinder. Reliable. I'll tell Ephra you did well. Thank you. I appreciate it. I do want our people to get along help each other you proved it this time at least you need to get the weapons where they belong but Keldo would want me to help you I have things you can use and I want to see your credits for myself trade okay works for me resources are scarce for us if you'll take credits I'll trade it's a start my inventory is open to you anything you need and do you have anything of interest? Okay, soil or salvage. And then what else? Okay, nothing else. It is opened up doors or something or other places to explore they be allowed here. nope got it then guess we're just gonna leave Aya and go to the nexus that was a quick pit stop Uh, and we also have AVP points and all that. Which I think I can do it from the Tempest as well. But since we're going to the Nexus, might as well. Welcome back. Thank you, Sylvie. Okay, nothing else opened. Unfortunate that I cannot skip this one. Only the traveling between planets. There's the Nexus. Just gonna skip and still not fully built. So I have like four quests out here. Actually, three because the firefighters I need to wait for a uh, email. But the others I can do it, you know, the movie night and all that. Right, and do we have anything? Mm, 
You still have question mark over there. Okay. I guess we're gonna do the game of poker. Uh, what about? Is there not anything new here? Contact made with Angaran Resistance. The Human Pathfinder has made contact with the legendary Angaran Resistance. The rebel group has fought a protracted war with the cat on the ice planet known as Vold since long before the Nexus arrived in the cluster. Resistance reception to Milky Way species is reportedly warming. Nice. Victory and Vold. A major cat stronghold on Vold has fallen. A decisive blow to cat operations on the ice planet. Resistance leader Anik Dosel praised the efforts of the initiative. We work together to defeat a common enemy, she told HNS. I foresee a great deal of collaboration in the future. Nice. Outpost on Vold. An in initiative outpost has been established on Vold. The ice planet isn't the most hospitable home, even in Helios, but the resistance and initiative colonists pledge to make it work. The settlement has been dubbed. Tarve Uni and will focus on extracting ice to provide water for the fleet and other colonies. Ancient AI rumored. Rumor persists that an ancient AI was discovered in a long abandoned city below, below Vold's frozen surface. Initiative brass have refused to confirm multiple accounts, but three independent and reliable sources confirm its existence. Is this referring to me and PB and Joe? Because we were the three that went down there. I don't know, maybe I should have stayed. Those ships were grounded for so long. Nice to see them doing what they were made to. Should I apply for an outpost? Anything else happening around here? Possibly. We do more good out there than I can stop here. Uh you talking to me? Uh hi. <laughs> Gil Brody is your engineer, right? Yeah, that's right. I'm Bailey. I used to work with him in the hangars here. You wouldn't happen to know if he's available, would you? Uh, if you're referring in a personal manner, that's not exactly my business. I wouldn't know. Right. Okay. Sorry to bother you. Just uh, tell him I said hi, huh? Okay. Next time I'm talking with him, then yeah. Anyone else around here? Don't really think so. Right, let's go to the vortex. Bartenders, are you alright? I see you're talking, but we can talk. The vortex. There we go. Dutch. Hello. Yeah, still not really happy about it. Right, Gil. So, Ryder, big news. I think I found my purpose in life. Oh yeah? What's that? Uh, thrashing you at poker. Should I deal? Ryder. I can read Gil's vital signs and give you an advantage during the game if you like. <laughs> you know what? Whatever. It's just a game of poker. Yes. Do it. The Pathfinder has spoken. Ooh. Were you holding out on me? You're pretty good at this. Don't act so surprised. Poker's lost me several friends over the years. The only one who still plays me is my buddy Jill. I I know, I know, Jill and Gil. Hmm. Is she the one that made you come here? The one you mentioned. Uh, part of the initiative? Yep. Been awake since the start. Jill's a fatality expert. Heads the initiative CRC. My only real friend from back home. I bet 50. I call. The CRC? Colonial Repopulation Committee. She's always teasing that I'm making her job harder. Says if I'm not making babies, I'm part of the problem. We have that kind of relationship. Well, sooner or later, we're gonna have to do that. 
Growing our numbers is paramount to our survival here. Sure. But that's Jill's purpose. I'm not just going to adopt it. See what I did there? I'm not just going to adopt it. I saw. You should mm -hmm. meet her. Weak. You'll see. She's amazing. Another hundred. He's nothing. I call. Oof, nice. That one's yours. Well, the winning streak's over. You beat me, Ryder, fair and square. Guess I continue searching for my true purpose in life. Well, I'm not gonna admit that I cheated, so... Maybe I just got lucky. Cards went my way. Beginner's luck. Pedal that somewhere else. You're no beginner. Jill's gonna lay into me hard when she hears you won. Ah, I'll just tell her this proves how bad a player she is. Mm -hmm. Out. Of course. Have fun. And thanks for the game. Anything else, Jill? Thanks again for the game, Ryder. Always. Right. And that should be done. We were where exactly? Nexus. No, not that one. Tempest. Okay, movie. Movie night. Where's that one? Do I have to right. travel to another place? Uh, yeah. Should be operations, right? Yeah, there it is. Top scientists have a few answers as the dark energy anomaly known as the scourge limits. Okay, I'm here. Any quests around? Now that it shows. A communication in the cluster. Is that the, the... No, it's not in the Pathfinder. Right. Any logistics updates are due well, that was easy. So we're gonna have to return to the Tempest. That's done. There's something, something around here. Should be written with Gil, right? Game of poker. And where was it? PB. And that's about it. Right. But I'm gonna leave it here for now. And in the next part, we're gonna explore a bit more of the Nexus and see if we have any more people around that are new and we can chat about chat about it. And then meet with PB and see where we go afterwards from there in the meantime hope you enjoyed this part guys and as always don't forget take care